Hi everybody, welcome back to Genotopia. This is declutter number two of my shoes and it looks like it's going to be three or four of, of these. So this is what number two looks like. And like I said, I've had over 300 pairs of shoes and I've already decluttered several times. So I know it's a shame. <laughs> I want to be ashamed, but to, I'm really working hard on trying to get my number down to in a reasonable number of shoes. So, um, you saw what I did in number one. If you've not, I'll have it linked to where you can go back and look at number one. So, let's just get started, and uh, please no bad comments. Um, it's just, uh, I have a shoe fetish. I love shoes. Uh yeah, I just love shoes. So let's just get started right here. This old pair of uh, Ocean Pacific flip-flops, those are going to the trash. Nobody will want those. Um, let's get started on this box right here. There's two pairs of sandals in here. I'm going to keep both pair of these. These I've only wore a couple times this year. This pair right here I bought and not worn at all, but I'm going to keep them. They're um, just big block heels. I'm going to keep both pairs of those. Okay, here is a pair of Michael Kors. Ooh, those are dirty. I'm going to have to clean those up. But this is a pair of Michael Kors um, black pumps. I'm going to keep those shoes. Here is a pair of Dextrite, Dextrite shoes. These shoes are older than the heels, but I love them. They're very comfortable. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep those. Here is a pair of Vince Camuto sandals. Um, I've, like I said, I beat up the heels on them, but these were very, very expensive sandals. I love them. These are in pewter. I think it's the color on these, but I love these. I bought these sandals after I had a near-death experience, and I'm not joking. I almost died, and I bought these sandals, and I love them, and I'm going to keep those sandals. I also bought them in gold, so I'm going to keep both pairs of those sandals. No judgment, please. No judgment. Uh, my husband loves these shoes, and I'll tell you, I think if they'd had them in his size, he would have probably bought a pair of them for himself. They are just, uh, they're by Nine West. They're just a chrome loafer, and uh, he loves these sandals. He loves them when I wear them, and uh, I don't particularly like these shoes, but my husband loves them, so I'm going to keep these and wear these for my husband because he loves them so very much. Next is a pair of yellow BC, uh, BOC uh, Born Concept flats. These um, I, I like. Um, I love BOCs. It's one of my favorite brands, so I'm going to keep those. You are not doing too well this time. Okay, here is a pair of that I can get rid of. These are just a little pair of burgundy uh, thong sandal flats. I will get rid of that pair. Here's another pair that I can get rid of. These are the shoes I had the day that I fell and broke my leg. I did not have them on when I fell and broke my leg. I probably would not have fallen when I broke my leg because they have a rubber sole. I had kicked them off. They're mootsy tootsies. I had kicked them off um, before going down the steps because I was trying to be so careful and not have heels on when I went down the steps uh, at work and uh, fell and broke my leg. Um, because the basement had flooded, and uh, anyway, long story, fell and broke my leg. May have not had if I had had these rubber sole shoes on. Anyway, um, bad situation, workers' comp sucks, blah, 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 blah. But I ain't wanted to clutter those shoes. Bad memories. Here is a pair of Italiano shoes. Uh, they're about wore out, but I think I can get one more season out of them. I love these little sparkly rhinestone sandals sequin sandals i love them i think i'm going to keep them one more season mm, let's see let's put these in the maybe pile. Maybe, pile. maybe pile here's a pair of bear trap sandals bear traps are nice sandals you get them on hsn or qvc 
I'm not sure. But anyway, I like my Bear Trap sandals. I will keep them. If you've never tried Bear Trap, Bear Traps are really nice leather sandals. And I will be keeping those. Uh, here is another pair of sandals that I will be keeping. Ooh, cat fur. These are an Italian brand shoe, and they're really cute, and I really like these. These are blingy, and I will be keeping those. Here is a pair of Fergie-licious sandals. They're really, really cute. They've got a really cute little uh, rose on the front, and they're really cute to wear with a sundress, so I will be keeping those sandals. Rarely wear them, but if I wanted to wear a really cute sundress, I would have those to wear with it. Here is another pair of BOCs. I love BOCs, like I said before. I will be keeping this pair of little uh, turquoise sandals. I really like those, and especially since I got rid of that pair of silver and turquoise, I will be keeping these. If you've not tried that brand, you really need to try them. They are great. Here is a pair of uh, Easy Spirit little sandals. I really like that little pair of sandals. Cute with jeans. I really like them. Nothing fancy, just really comfortable. Like them, keeping them. Enough said. Okay, here is a pair that I bought, just like those pink ones that I bought and got rid of. Bought them, never wore them. I'm gonna put those in the maybe pile. Okay, here is a pair of um, rain boots. I do use these in the spring when it rains. Um, my yard gets really, really wet. So, okay, here. So, I will keep these in because I do use those. So, I will keep those. Uh, here is a pair of um, Clarks. They're just little um, shooties. Shoe boots, whatever they call. Anyway, I do like these. They're nice and leather and really comfortable. I do like those and get a lot of use out of those. So I'm going to keep that pair. Oh, these are warped. I need to uh, fix these. These are styling company. These either come from Pennies or I think these come from QVC. Um, I like these. These are really cute. I am going to keep those with that little coral bow on them. I like these in the springtime and the summertime, so I'm going to keep that pair of shoes. Now, here's a pair that came from QVC. These are hot in Hollywood. I think I may may have wore these one time. Um, they were comfortable. Um, but I'm going to get rid of them. Here's a pair of Steve Madden's. Normally, I really like Steve Madden's, but for some reason, these pair do not stay on my feet as well as my other Steve Madden's. These are really, really cute. They're sparkly and cute, but I'm going to get rid of that pair of Steve Madden's for some reason. They don't work. Here is a pair of uh, inexpensive blue shoes. I need a nice pair of blue heels, but this is not them, so I'm getting rid of those. Here is a pair of suede look faux snake skin trim i'm getting rid of those here is a pair of memory foam sketchers um like i said i forgot i had this pair of tennis shoes when i bought the other tennis shoes when i bought another pair of tennis shoes but i'm going to go ahead and keep this pair so i'm keeping those and here is a pair of cheeks from HSN. You just slide into these. Um, I'm going to put those in the maybe pile. They look horrible, but I wore more and more. And here is a pair of shoes that uh, can go bye-bye. These are New York Transit shoes, and they have just seen better days. The insoles, insides are just worn out, so those are going to go bye-bye. Here is a pair of dance goes. You know, I love dance goes. Dance goes are an expensive brand. Uh, they're really comfortable and I love them. These are gray suede with the black patent. Love, love, love those. So I'm keeping those. 
And here is a pair of bear traps. I love bear traps. I got these off of HSN and love that pair of shoes. They are so very comfortable. So I'm keeping that pair of black leather shoes. Oh, allergies going wild. Here is a pair of Vince Camudos. Those are really, really pretty. Got those off of, uh, I think these are on HSN or QVC. They're in rose gold. I'm going to keep those for special wear. I don't wear those a whole lot because of the heel on them, but they're Vince Camudos, so got to keep those. Now, here's a little pair that I've got that I haven't worn yet. They're um, blue suede with some little... Uh, detailing on them. Um, I'm just going to keep those to wear this fall. I think they're really cute. If they're not comfortable, then I'll get rid of them. But I got them on good sale and I'm going to go ahead and keep those and try those out. See how comfortable those are for the fall. Here's a pair of navy heels that I have worn absolutely out. They need clean. They were very, very pointed toed. Nice leather shoes. If they weren't so pointed, I would keep them. But, um, they're really, really, really pointed toe, and I used to love the more pointed the better, but I have absolutely wore that out, and um, it's time for those to go bye-bye. And here's a pair of Nine West shoes that I bought at either Peebles or Belks, and um, they're really, really cute. Haven't worn them yet, but they're red suede, and I'm going to keep a pair of shoes. Here's a pair of shoes. Oh, what brand are they? I don't know what brand they are. But um, I think it's time to let that pair of shoes go. Here's two pair of shoes that won't be going anywhere because they're fit flops, and you know how I love my fit flops. I think this was the first pair that I ever owned. If I, When I saw these on HSN, I thought, man, those shoes are so ugly. I wouldn't pay the $119. But let me tell you, these shoes are so amazing on your feet. I don't care how ugly they are. I'm keeping both pairs of these shoes. These shoes are amazing. When you've got bad feet, let me tell you. I used to wouldn't wear an ugly pair of shoes for money. Now I pay a lot of money for them. Here's another pair of New York um, transit shoes, similar to the ones that I've just got rid of. These are pretty new. I think I've only worn them once or twice. I'm going to keep this pair. Got into the others, keeping this pair. Here's a little pair of red sandals that my friend Pam picked up for me. These are Airstep. These are really, really comfortable and it's just nice to have a little pair of red sandals to wear with your jeans or whatever in the summer. So I'm keeping those. And here's a little pair of uh, Solos uh, that I picked up. Those are really, really cute. I like those in the fall and winter. So I'm keeping those. Those are a houndstooth pattern. Not doing as well at this segment as I did the last ones, but uh, still I've got rid of several pair. Here is another pair of the Fit Flops. This pair I have worn so much they are stretched out because I've worn them with socks, but keeping that pair of babies, I'll wear them with socks this winter. It doesn't matter around the house. Here is a pair of uh, Karen Scott Leopard um, shoes. I really like that pair of Leopard shoes for the winter because they're kind of a suede feeling, so I'm keeping that pair. And I need to be ashamed of myself. Here's a pair of Vince Camudos that I bought off of HSN this year. And I have never even had this pair of shoes on my feet. And they are such a pretty blush color. Look at that shoe. How gorgeous. Just take a minute to admire the beauty of that shoe. I'm keeping it. I need to be ashamed of myself. I haven't even worn it. It's Vince Camudo, girls. I have some beautiful shoes and I have some ugly shoes, but you know, 
I think we all do. Here is a pair of shoes, and I had these in solid black and gave them to my brother because these are a unisex shoe. And I didn't realize these when I bought these, but these are camo. But these are dance goes also. And these shoes are just what, these are what the doctors and the nurses wear all over the hospital. But these shoes are so comfortable. Um, I wear these a lot in the winter when I'm working snow duty just because they are so comfortable. And, um, yeah, I'm keeping those ugly camouflage shoes. I never thought I would ever own anything camouflage, Erica. This is my one and only camouflage item in my entire wardrobe of clothes, shoes, jewelry, anything. My one and only, only camouflage are dance goes. And you know how expensive dance goes are. Here it is. Camo dance goes. Keeping them. Okay, you all are going to laugh your butts off. Check out those. Yes, I own them. They're from Wild Rose. I have a love relationship with this pair of shoes. I love those. <laughs> Are those not the wildest shoe you've ever seen? I love them. I do. I love them. <sighs> those are going in the baby pile. If my husband sees me get rid of those, he'll be quite upset. So uh, those are going over here in the baby pile. And here is just a pair of flip flops. They're very, very comfy. They have memory foam M in them, so I'm going to keep those to wear around the house. Those do not get worn outside the house. Okay. And here is a pair of rhinestone sandals. And this one right here looks like it needs to be fixed back. But anyway, I'm keeping those because they are blingy. You know me, they're blingy. Keeping those. I bought this when I did radio and like to be seen from everywhere. Well, I can't reach the other one. Come on. Here is another little pair of Ocean's Pacific flip flops. Um, I will keep those because sometimes when you go to public places and you need a pair of flip flops to like go into a share room or something. I need a pair of flip-flops or something like that, so I will keep these because I would not mind throwing those away, so I will keep those for that purpose. And these shoes right here are older than the heels, but I'm not getting rid of those. I love these shoes. I love, love, love them. I have had them forever, and um, I will keep them forever until they fall apart because I love these. I got these from Lane Bryant 50 years ago, and uh, I will keep them for another 50 years. Love those shoes. Yes, I'm not doing good. I'm just doing better. And here is a pair of Ivanka Trump shoes. I love this shoe. Very, very cute. Nice little leather. Just beautiful detailing. I love that shoe, and I keep that little form in it so that it will hold their shape. I love those, and not getting rid of my Ivanka Trump shoes. Ivanka Trump. And, come on, little booty. I know you all can't see it over there, but I'm fighting it. I'm fighting for it. I only got two pair of shoes left in this round. Two roundus. Okay, here is a little pair of Clark's booties. I love these. I wear these a lot, lot, lot in the winter, so I'm keeping these. They're nice leather. They have a cute little square button detail. They're just very comfortable, and I really like Clark's. So keeping that shoe. And the last shoe in my collection is a little pair of very pointy toed snake skin shoes and I wore them so much that I wore the name brand of them out. I can't see it anymore but I'm going to part with that shoe. So that is round two of my declutter. So thank you for staying with me and I will see you in my round three of my declutter and remember to share the love not the hate. Love you.